what is going on guys welcome back to the channel we got the 2014 mustang gt premium package with the manual transmission so i went ahead yesterday i got jba long tube headers i've like it's been my dream guys to get a jba slash any kind of long tube header set up on a 2014 mustang gt so i got a jba long tube headers um no cats and then i got an x-pipe ford performance x-pipe and then i deleted the resonators and these mufflers are roush mufflers so we got roush muffler tips and then we got jba long tube headers and then we just we got the bama performance tune i did choose three tunes in there so we got tune number one is gonna be it's gonna be 93 race so 93 race is gonna give it everything she got and then the other tune is 93 performance that's gonna be for daily use and then the third tune which i'm so excited about is gonna be for car meets slash you guys to enjoy because it's gonna be a ghost cam tune a lot of mixed opinion about ghost cam tunes but i love it i'm so excited man i can't wait to see how it sounds but yeah we're about to plug this in i just downloaded the tune files from the pc i hope you guys are having an amazing day sit back relax enjoy the video i'm gonna put you guys in wide angle i've heard a lot of mixed opinions about bama so i really hope to god that it's a really good tune but there's no way to find out except trying and we'll see all right there we go Program vehicle, street use notice, continue, turn key on, and turn the key on. It is so hot in here. Got the key and turn key on, continue. We're going to go ahead and put the ghost cam first. There we go. So we're going to put the ghost first and then we'll try the other ones. But I really want to hear that uh, ghost cam tune, see what how that does. We got the check engine light flashing, global spark, axle ratio, tire size, rev limit 7K, rev limit 7, speed, ghost. Okay, I guess approve. How can we, okay, approve. Everything just went dark. The key is still on. I love this screen, man. It is so big, but unlocking processor, syncing stock data, saving stock. Okay, the, the good thing is this thing saves your stock data. So worst of the worst, if the tune goes horribly wrong for some reason, you can always go back to your stock tune, which I'm excited about um, just in case. But hopefully, guys, look at my thought process, right? Lund tune with the device is almost seven eight hundred bucks right this thing was four hundred dollars with three tunes so even if i want to get the lund tune which they say is the best that's about 300 bucks and this is 300 this is 400 so i still paid the same amount as getting just the device and the tune and one tune from them so this way i have the device now if i want to loon, uh, load a different tune just in case if these tunes are bad but hopefully they're good but if they are bad i can always go to lund and pay 325 it was the same thing as me buying the whole kit from them it was going to be around seven eight hundred but yeah, we're at 30%. I'm going to cut it off and I'll turn it back on when the car is ready. All right, guys. So it's done saving the stock data. And now it just started downloading the tune. So ECU downloading tune. Once the tune is all downloaded, I will put this back on. We'll turn the car on and hear it together for the first time. I really would love for you guys to like, it would mean a lot to see you guys enjoying the Mustang as much as I am. And I know most of you guys are here for bikes and I promise you this is staying a bike channel. We got a lot of more bikes on the way. I was even thinking about going crazy and getting a Ninja H2, man. I, I've seen just almost everybody so obsessed with that bike, man. So I don't know if I should even get a Yamaha R9 because the hype of it might die, die down later on or just go for the full kill man leap of faith and get the top of the top and even sell this one day if I need to. But yeah, man, it's going to be a bike channel. But this car I want to keep for now and I love you guys. I would love for you to enjoy it as much as I am. All right, the tune seems like it's done. Download complete. Tune has been programmed successfully to vehicle. Turn key off. 
Okay, we got everything flashing. Turn key off. Then let's do done. I guess that's it now. Give it a cold start and I think it's good to go.